Hey guys, I uh, just wanted to make a video, kind of my season recap so far. Uh, so I started Sorceress, even though everyone says don't start Sorceress. I understand why very quickly. Uh, you can only farm really one area. Um, I'm going to kind of go over her today and how I got around some of that. Um, I have a Summoning Druid, and I have Map Zaddy, which right now is Golems. I uh, don't know 100% what I'm going to do with it. Obviously, I like the Summon builds. I feel like the Druid's kind of playing that, uh, made this to be Dark Pack or Golems or Mages, something a little bit different. We're also working on an Assassin and a Barbarian just for kicks and giggles. But like I said, today we're going to go over the Sorceress. Um, so I'm going to go over what I think is the best budget, middle of the tier kind of rundown. Um, that is obviously a Lightning Sorceress. Um, so right now I have 1 point Wonder and Warmth. Also through one in Shivering Armor, so that's four hard points. Um, so that kind of hurts a little bit on some builds. Here, I'm just maxing Chain, uh, Lightning, Chain Lightning, and Lightning Masterfee. Uh, the rest right now I'm in Thunderstorm. You could certainly put it in a Teleport. You could put it in a Static. You could slap over here and get some more defense that my character desperately needs. Strength's just enough to equip a Monarch, which probably could be Respec now, um, but I'm out of Respec, so I actually started Hydra Sorceress, quickly realized the Pierce nerf hurts a little bit more than I thought, went to Combustion, went to this build, um, but I accidentally held Shift and put all my points in Strength, uh, so I had to use my last Respec to get where I am now. Uh, nothing in Dex, nothing in Energy, Rest in Vitality. So whenever I kind of finalize this build, I'll uh, go back through. Uh, but this is 200 FCR, so that's the big point on this. Uh, makes it really nice to teleport. Makes it nice to, you know, really spam those lightning spells if you need to. Do have a little bit high in lightning resist right now, and I'm just trying to get it kind of situated. Um, charms are just kind of random, whatever I found to get you know some life, some resistance. Um, I had a torch, I sold it. Kind of wanted to go over this build before I switched to Infinity. Um, so if you don't know already, we're running Mang Songs. So the big change on Mang Songs for the season was that 16% chance to cast 20 lower resistance. Um, so if you don't know, lower resistance, conviction, and static can all kind of stack together. Um, certainly some enemies are not breakable. Um, but with lower resistance and level 40 static off of my Mercenary Stormspire, uh, that will break most things that are breakable. Um, so Stormspire I picked up pretty cheap. It was about Ist, uh, about day three or day four. And then the main songs I picked up just before I picked up that. And I got this one for low, which we got from Arcane. Uh, we picked up a Griffins. So that negative enemy light resistance on both of these makes a huge difference. Uh, before this, I was running just a crap... Um, I don't really know how to say it, Enchantras, um, in two skills, negative lightning, enemy resistance, or damage one, and I paid like two with us for it. I had a three plus all lightning skills um, circlet on here. Um, I still have the Ami, uh, just rocking it, just to get the plus three there. Um, slammed it myself and got the max resistance, which really doesn't do much for my build. Uh, Viper Magi, which we got like day two. Uh, we were kind of flipping these to make some currency at the beginning. Mage Fist, again, picked it up pretty cheap. I think I paid like a pull for these. 10 FCR rings, so that's just really hit the break point. And then my buddy is amazing at casting the, at uh, crafting these. So this is my 20 FCR belt, uh, so that's what gets me to that break point. And then just some random crafted uh, boots, so that's just to get some resistance that I desperately needed. The mech just really has just kind of a random assortment of stuff. So I found this, so I slapped it on him. Tal's mask would work just fine here. It really needs an armor upgrade. So I found this, and it's been sitting on here because I was running Act 3 before I got this. And same thing, you'll see some FCR. Found these, so I slapped these on here to get some crushing blow. Also that, you know, PDR, and then just random again. Gloves need to upgrade those, maybe Drax or something, uh, whatever, wherever I come across. Um, so, do want to kind of show off some of the build. So, you can really do whatever you want to do. Um, starting out, like I said, I ran Fire Sorceress, so I farmed a lot of Andy. Um, 
that works out great because you know this whole level here is an eye level 85 so that makes you know random merc kills or if you want to stop and kill packs pretty good chain lightning is pretty awesome here so you'll see those are lightning immune and it kind of just works them and you really don't have to worry about too much in act one um if you go to like trav or if you try and kill meth you know there's some issues here um I'll show Meth. Meth is probably one of the harder ones. Trav, you can kind of stick back and be okay. Uh, really just a lot of willing and dealing this season. Um, as always, though, for me. That's kind of my bread and butter. So we'll come out of here and... Ooh, there it is. Right by the beginning. I usually like to clear this way a bit. Uh, you can go straight in, but I kind of like to pull these guys. So they're going to be light and immune. It will break them. It's just a little tough. Like, those Hydras hurt. I'm not going to lie. So you'll see the lower resistance cast, and there's one that I can't break. But that's where the Merc comes into play. So because he's Act 2 and not Act 3, I'm getting that physical damage from him. Ooh, and you'll see here, right? It's a it's a little bit difficult. Let me get some pots. And I, I don't have a cannot be frozen. Uh, there's a couple ways I could get it. It's not that important to me right now. So we'll let him take that guy out. And then meth. So now that I have meth by himself, he'll kind of just melt. And in essence, got plenty of those unfortunately right now. So that does pretty well. Um, Diablo is also pretty easy. I mean, obviously I kind of cheese it. Hey, we'll see if we get some streamer luck. Hey, hey, looky there. Needed that. Uh, find something to toss out of here. Move these over real fast. It's a sick. And I'm nearly maxed out my resistance. So, we'll show Diablo. Haven't had a lot of good luck out of charms. Uh, ran a lot of arcane. Found a burr yesterday uh, from Cal's, but that was on my summoning druid. Uh, so, the best thing I kind of did is I sold my torch and ended up with a druid torch uh, from my unid. Had a really low sorceress that, you know, we'd farm some keys and a friend was running keys. So I had him run it for the Black Soulstone chance. So you'll see, I mean, kind of, it kind of makes easy work here. Diablo, of course, I'm a, I'm a little squishy. I mean, that all res charm will certainly help a little bit for now. Uh, we'll pass it along. Ooh. So I do need my infinity base. So a large reason why I'm making this video is I hope for the next video I will have my infinity. And so there you'll see, can't break him. But the Merc does enough. And so that's all you need. Uh, if you don't know one of the changes are, you're not going to get the drops from just popping like I just did. Uh, you only get it for stuff you kill. So I know a lot of people, myself included, used to find some runes and other things. Um, so that was always nice. But that goes away. Completely understandable, though. It was definitely a cheese. Um, so here, I mean, you can pretty easily farm Diablo. Uh, Prime Evil Souls don't have the value that they did last season right now. I expect they'll go up. Nothing great there, but again, it's a Diablo kill. Uh, we'll show Bell real quick. I'm probably starting to run a little long. Yeah, I'm about nine minutes right now. Um, I do like to run these just kind of flowing for you guys so you get a good idea of you know what we're looking at here i'm not really looking at these items i just need some gold Ooh, i, I will look at that a little bit closer though all right sick i gambled all my gold away earlier so worried about souls here teleporting all right so we'll come out of here yep there's some souls and boom right to level three and looky there, there's Throne. So no real issue with the Bell Waves. Um, even if there's a Lightning Immune, you know, there's not really anything that's going to make or break me. Um, Souls, certainly an issue. Not going to pretend they're not. But the Waves are pretty easy. Uh, looks like there's still Dark Lord down here. And that's where you see that lower resistance. So I didn't, I didn't see the Dark Lord, but I saw the aura over top, and I was like, "Yeah, that's probably a problem." Or I guess the status, not the aura. 
But just charms, like I said, if anyone's interested, there's nothing nothing of any real value in here. Uh, this side is sort of my better stuff. It looks like there's kind of a random one there I need to toss back out. So, Merc, I mean, he needs an armor. He gets poisoned. He likes to try and die. Nothing too crazy here. I mean, that's pretty nice. Um, really need to get some skillers. So my damage is a little low with Porch. It was up to 12k. So that was quite nice. Um, you know, the bosses seem to not melt as easy uh, without the torch. I mean, I definitely will feel it here on Diablo. And so this, this character can map, you know, certainly at the point it's at. Um, it's not great. You know, it's certainly better in a party. I had a friend that ran... Uh, Vengeance Pally and ran Conviction to start, and then he's kind of swapped over now to farming keys and zeal. Um, so I'll link to one of his videos, but he's running the exact same Sorcerer's build. So he's kind of the one that, you know, called out to me early in the season when uh, beta was still going on. And I said, well, that seems like a fun thing to try. I uh, don't want to start Lightning Sorcerers just because it's a little hard to gear knowing that you need Infinity. Uh, this works much better than we were expecting. Um, so you'll see there the static's getting casted. It will cast on my mouse for the lower resistance. So lower resistance got casted. I certainly run out of mana. I mean, you're not getting an insight here. But, I mean, pretty easy and safe bell kill. Like, not something I'm too worried about there. And, yeah. But that's it. Um, hopefully next time I will have Infinity. And uh, we'll see what this thing will do in maps.